Makoto Nakamura, no world or continental or K1 medalist. Power, Burning Blue, also from Japan, Ken Nishimura. Ken Nishimura, also from Japan, bronze medalist in the World Championships in 2018. He's also been world champion at under 21 level. Three times Karate World winner. Nishimura came through the round 0 0 1 1, had a fabulous 5 3 win, beating the current world champion, who is Goncha Barman Ashkari from Iran. Then he went on to have a 3 3 draw and lost on a split decision on Hante 2 3. Close. Very, very close. So he's on form, Nishimura, wearing the blue colors from Japan. Up against an, another teammate from Japan, Ryoto Nakamura. Coming through the rounds, he also beat a Karate One champion, uh, Thomas Scott from the United States. So again, we're seeing Japan putting forward some fabulous athletes and again we see both of them from Japan being so respectful of each Absolutely. other not wanting to give away anything these two will be vying for that opportunity to represent their country in the Olympics in 2020 and it is Nishimura who delivers that Jordan Uramawashi as Nakamura came in. Yep, good timing. Three points on the board and the central advantage. Two minutes of the three-minute bout. Ken Nishimura still sitting in the center of the tatami, not phased by the fact that he is winning three points to zero. He still wants more points. He wants to convince the Japanese selectors yep. as much as anybody else that he is the man. Just, uh, just, gesticulating to the referee. That um, can you just have a look at my colleague over there? Uh, I think he might have an injury. <laughs> Looks like there's a, a little blood on the nose of Ryoto Nakamura. so similar in, in style both of these and yep. Nakamura just 22 years old and Nishimura 23 years old so they're very very similar mm. He's still very much on the front foot isn't he Ken? He is, he is. Of the two on paper he is experience with a number of Karate One Premier League wins to his name, three of them in fact, and silvers. So three times a uh, bronze medal. Whereas Ryoto Nakamura hasn't won at any level at the moment. He's now going to receive a, a warning for holding on. Second level. Just 
close the distance down, don't they? Just slowly. Yep. Even them. Try to find that opening. Yep. Well, he's only got 26 seconds left to do something about this. He's trading three points to zero, and they sent you against him, so he needs four points to win it. Yep. A few legs coming up. I think we do. Jordan and Oran will watch the attempt again from Ken Nishimura. Anton Kachui now. No more opportunities for error from Ryoko Nakamura. Video review challenge here. For Nakamura. And let's have a look, see if we can detect a Technique, there's a Churamawashi there, you saw. There's a Churamawashi. Here's the Churamawashi coming in there. But whether it had the vigorous application, the Zanchin, the proper timing, correct distance, all those six of the criteria, good form yep. being one of them. Yep. So, no card on Hansok Oh, oh okay. fantastic. That's it. That's just, that, that's the best. <laughs> I think that's the best dip bomb we've seen that so is, far yep, today. Yeah, do, definitely. Clean, so, so and clear. And that was from Ken Nishimura. Right on the money. With one second to go. Clean, clean will and win in the end there. Absolutely. Six points oh. to zero. And really, he's uh, stamping his authority for that... Uh, Spot. For that spot yeah. in Tokyo. Absolutely. Like 75. May get an opportunity to have a look at the video replay of some of those exciting techniques. That kick, that last kick. That last one in particular was brilliant. We'll, we'll lean back. There's the Uramawashi. That was the first of the three yep. point scores. There's the second one. From being inside brilliant, as well. Brilliant replay. Yeah, yep. Spot.